人の数だけ物語がある F ・マリノスに関わるすべての人たちにも物語がある「マリビト」かつてオーストラリア代表をワールドカップに導きアジアカップ優勝をももたらした男の代名詞自らアクションを起こしアグレッシブにゴールに向かうアタッキングフットボール。の隣で見つけた宝物こそアンジェのすべてだ。アンジェの生まれはギリシャアテネ。彼が5歳の時、一家はオーストラリアメルボルンに移住した。1967年のクーデターで軍事政権になったギリシャ。経済も混乱する中、父ジムは一夜にして授業を失った。ちょうど彼が生まれた年。子どもたちの幸福を願いオーストラリアに移り住んだが父も母も朝から夜まで働き詰めの毎日しかし週末だけは特別な時間が流れていた。Yeah, yeah, of course. I mean, that was, yeah, that was、um, because my father,、um, you know, when we got to Australia, he, he would work、um, very long hours. And as a young boy, I would usually be asleep before he comes home from work. And, you know, I didn't really see him a lot during the week. But on the weekend, on the Sunday, we, we support the team we, you know, he took me to. And, you know, that Sunday afternoon every week, I could spend、uh, you know, a few hours with my dad、uh, watching, watching a game. ギリシャにルーツがあることを子供たちに忘れてほしくなかった父は時間があればアンジェとサッカーを見たそしてその時間こそが父とアンジェの絆を強くしていった。Yeah, coming from Greece where you know, football was、uh, his passion, and going to a country where there are other sports and you know, football was number one.、Um... He didn't understand the other sports at all, you know, and he, he still had a passion for, 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 for the game. So he, he passed that passion on to me. And I remember as a young boy, that was the most important time for me was when we go watch a game of football with my father. And that was、uh, our connection. And I think through that, I fell in love. I fell in love with the game, even though it wasn't you know, the number one sport in, in Australia. No, I think it was similar. I mean, obviously, I was influenced.、Um, Influenced by him, and he loved、uh, attacking players, he loved exciting players, he loved exciting teams, and you know that,、uh, that influenced me. And you know, I like the same thing. Chichi no Tonari de Mitsketa, Saka to you, Takaramono. Hassai de South Melbourne no use team in Kanu Stanjewa. Then she no Katawara, Saka no Honga, Katapash Kara Yomiasari. コーチングからサッカーの歴史までサッカーに関わることなら何でも学んだサッカーに関わる仕事に就きたいと夢見ていたアンジェにはユニークなエピソードがある12歳で進学したプラーランハイスクール学校のクラブにはサッカーに詳しい指導者がおらずなんとアンジェがコーチを担うことになったのだ When I see a 12 year old boy today, I think, you know, that was me. And, you know, why, why, did people, why were people listening to me when I was telling them what to do? It makes no sense. But obviously, they saw something in me that they believed in what I was telling them. And me as a 12 year old, 
you know, felt comfortable um, being in that sort of uh, role and um, that certainly sort of shaped my career later because um, you know, I think uh, I always looked to coaching as, as the area where I thought that's where my future lay. 信念を貫く姿勢は選手としてのアンジェも成長させた現役時代はサウスメルボルン一筋で活躍したアンジェキャプテンとして国内リーグを2度制しオーストラリア代表にも選出された Yeah, I did okay. You know, I was okay. I, I knew within myself that I was never going to be a top, top player. And,、um, but, you know, I, I, I worked really hard. I had a good attitude. And,、um, you know, I loved the game. I was passionate about the game. So I think more than my technical ability, it was more my sort of passion for the game that got me to, you know, play in the national team and, and win a couple of championships and be captain of the club. コーチの国内リーグはセミプロだったオーストラリア膝の怪我で27歳で引退したアンジェもサッカーだけでは食べていけずコーチ業の傍らで銀行員としても働いたそして監督としてのスタートは突然やってきた Yeah, the, the, the coach I was working with got sacked, and you know, the board, there w a s two games to go in that season, and said, Look, we want you to take over for the last two games. And you know, I, I didn't think about the last two games, I just thought there was an opportunity for me to start my career. And yeah, I, I mean, I quit my, my bank job, and、um, you know, I just said, I'm going to do everything in these two games to convince、uh, the club to you know, appoint me permanently. And, の情熱、そして強い信念がアンジェを突き動かし、監督の座をつかみ取った。Because I was so passionate about the game and coaching that I have no sort of fears or worries when it comes to that. So I was lucky. I found what I was passionate about very early in my life. And... Dynamic, その後。サウスメルボルンでチャンピオンシップ2連覇オーストラリアのユース年代を指導しブリスベンドアーでは36試合無敗の記録を打ち立てついにはオーストラリア代表監督としてワールドカップ出場アジアカップ優勝を果たす栄光を支えたのは強い信念そしてかつてエキサイティングでワクワクさせるサッカーへと自分を導いた父だった。いや、な、he wasn't one。な、ま、my father wasn't one to say well done when things were going well。usually when things are going well he would。you know not criticize me but tell me I could be better and do things better。I think、um,。he he knew how to。motivate me and、um,。he you know whatever I did was never。Was never going to be good enough, but at the same time, whenever I had some bad moments, and that's when he would tell me, you know, just keep believing in yourself, and, and you know, you'll, you'll, you'll create something special again. So, media から受ける批判よりも父の一言の方がよっぽど答えた。しかし、アンジェを鼓舞し続けた父はもういない。No, I am happy. I mean, I think, you know, I, I watch my father work very hard and make a lot of sacrifices,、um, you know, for me and, and, and I guess my sister. And the last game my father watched live was、um, us beating Sendai 8 2. And... He would have loved that game. It was, you know, that was everything he wanted goals, great football, and you know, I'm happy that, that that was the last game he ever saw.
見る人を熱狂させるアタッキングフットボールその進化が問われる2019年シーズンがアンジェにとっての2年目が幕を開ける It's, it's, not, it's not pressure, you know, wherever I've been at the start, it's always a little bit、uh, challenging, but that's because you're changing things. And, and I think you know, people usually, if things haven't been successful for a long time or haven't had success, they want something different. Now, they want something different, and then I come along and I do, I give them something different. But, Always at the beginning, it's a difficult period, and then people think maybe we shouldn't do something different, we should do what we were doing before, what everyone else does, because at least we knew what we were going to get. But、um, yeah, my belief is you stick on this path, you do things differently, you believe in something, and、um, you know,、um, first year, second year, third year doesn't,、uh, you know, to me, that's not what's important. What's important is that.、Um, when I came to this club and every club I've coached and everywhere I've coached, I've said I want to play this game in a certain way.、Um, I've, I've accomplished that everywhere I've been and, and I'll accomplish that here at Marinos too, where you know, people will say this team plays the football that I said we would play.